I'm going to talk about stepping high uh, during the aeration season. Um, there's many different tactics to obviously help you with this. A couple key ones I want to talk about. Um, the first one being is obviously efficiency, which is one of the most important things that you have to do during the day to maximize the amount of steps you can complete during a day of aeration. So uh, to give you a simple example, um, in a day when you're doing, let's say, 20 lawns, a lot of people between getting payment from the customer, collecting information, uh, you know, maybe taking a short break after the lawn, all these little things can add up very quickly and add another five minutes to every lawn that you do. And what people don't realize is that on 20 lawns times five minutes, well, that's not, a, well, that's almost 100 minutes. That's 100 minutes so over an hour and a half, which can obviously get you another five to 10 lawns by the end of the day. So a um, couple of key things to save you a lot of time is obviously number one, uh, pre-framing your payments. So you always wanna make sure that when you make your sale and you say, we're gonna get started on the lawn, you always say something along the lines of, okay, sir, well, when I'm done the lawn, if you can have the payment ready for me, that'd be very helpful. Please make the checkout to Canadian Property Starts for this amount with the HST, and I'll have that when I'm done. And that way you can save time at the end of every lawn that we, the homeowner doesn't have to go inside, find the checkbook, and you have to wait a few minutes at every single sale. Um, other things that can save you a lot of time as well, is, um, especially on a really big day, when this kind of stuff really takes place, is um, when you have several lawns lined up, you don't want to be stopping between every lawn to collect payment and collect information. If you have five or six lawns to do, you just aerate five or six lawns straight without stopping and then you have your uh, clipboard with your log sheet and you collect all the information, all the payments, all at the same time. That way you're doing one thing at a time and then another thing at a time. It saves you a lot of time from having to go back and forth to your backpack, to the binder, to the aerator, back and forth all day long. It saves a huge amount of time as well. Um, now. A really big thing for stepping high is uh, your personal expectations at the end of the day. And this is probably the biggest one that really maximizes your stepping abilities throughout the day and realizing that if you really want to have big days and step a lot of lawns, that 20 lawns isn't really a lot. And a lot of people think that way because they think about what they've already done throughout the day or what they've already accomplished. And um, a big thing that you want to remind yourself and the biggest phrase that you can keep reminding yourself throughout the day is one more lawn, one more lawn, one more lawn. And that's the only thing you want to think about all day because it's very easy when you're at 20 steps or 20 lawns completed by 5 p.m. to think, well, I'm doing pretty good. And then psychologically, you might maybe slow down or not push as hard at the door or not motivate yourself as well. But if you're only thinking about getting on the next lawn, well, then all of a sudden that 20 turns into 25 before you even know it. And then that 25 turns into 30 and so on and so forth. So um, being really efficient throughout the day as far as organizing your paperwork, collecting payments, keeping it short and sweet with customers and having high expectations of yourself what you expect from yourself is what you're going to create. And a lot of times if you expect a lot from yourself and you follow those systems and you're very efficient throughout the day, um, you might even get beyond your expectations by the end of the day as well. Thank you.